Oh gosh, what happened? Oh, what is that? Hello friends and welcome to Let's Play After the End, The Harvest. I'm your host Magic Man Mo. Full disclosure, this is a sponsored video. Information about that as well as a link to where you can find this game are in the description down below. But game sounds pretty interesting. It's some kind of open worldy sort of space faring thing. It's an it's a retro open world sci-fi action adventure. Yeah, retro open world sci-fi adventure. So let's uh I'm I'm set to exit. I don't want to exit. I want to hit new game. Let's jump into this without much further ado. Uh, we have story mode and adventure mode. I think we want to play on story mode. Play through the game from the start. Full tutorial. Recommend for new players. I am a new player. Save at any time after the tutorial. Uh, adventure mode. Start the game from one of eight random starting locations across the universe. There's a universe involved. With a spaceship nearby. Play through the game freely. No tutorial. Recommend it for experienced players. Save only at predetermined locations. Well, we're going to play story mode. Story oh. mode. Let's do this. Please read the manual before playing. Yes, I totally did that. I, uh, mmm, totally. <laughs> Press F1 to configure controls. Okay, okay. Hopefully I won't need to. I'm just gonna uh, hope that everything's okay. You can save any time through the menu after the tour. Oh, we're loading. I'm like, why are we so, well, what is all this? Okay, there are little hints and tips for us while we load up the universe. Ooh, that's nice. Well, can you hear me? What's it? Nareth? What? Did you just say something? Can... can you understand me? Uh, where am I? Where am I? You're currently within a, an assembly point outpost. My name is Lunue. I guess. L Lunui? Lanui? Lanui, sure. My colleague Apollo and I brought you here. Oh. Ugh. My body feels strange. Mm. Oh, no! Your body is something wrong? N no, it's just. It's sore. Oh, well, that's a relief then. A little bit of pain is certainly to be expected after what you went through. Uh, would you like to see if you can stand up? Maybe even put on some clothes? Or not, you know, wink, hee <laughs> There's a few things I think that we should discuss. Uh, yeah. Just, uh, give me a moment. Press the arrow keys to walk. Okay. Press enter to interact. Okay. Oh, oh. Welcome to space! Main quest, Lanui has asked you to put on some clothes. <laughs> Mission one, put on some clothes. You naked son of a fool. Objectives, equip clothes and follow Lanui. Nine experience for that and ten gold. I accept this mission. Would you like to re uh, view some extra information about controls? Uh, this is recommended for first time players breaking the fourth wall. Yes, I better I better do that. Control Controls can be accessed through the key. <laughs> oh, hello. Okay, can, okay, I'm good. I think I've got the control. I think I've got the controls. I can move. 
All right. Ooh. Oh, I can move diagonally. That's pretty exciting, actually. What is this? Is this... Da -da -da -da. You can access your menu. I love that uh. guitar riff. Hey, come on now. Don't you want to get started? Put those clothes on. Oh. Uh. Okay, you seem to have enough strength to walk. Now put those clothes on and follow me. Um, uh, yes. Items, please. Uh, use, I think. Uh, oh, uh, second? Secondary. Casual clothes. Maybe I'm already wearing it? Oh, equip! I need to go to equip. Excuse me. As you can see from- As you can see from your digital implants, you can now track some neat things about yourself. The digital implant not only helps us monitor your overall health more easily, it also lets you keep track of items, quests, and equipment. So, that's like the GUI, right? You know, our health and, and the blue bar and everything, that's- that's our digital implant. We were like some kind of like cyborg person. At least we've been able to save some of the technology. Alright, how do I... I need to go back into my... Uh. Hey, come on now! Don't you want to get started? Put those clothes on! Uh, I know, I... <laughs> I know, I know, I forgot how to get to the menu. I will remember, I just forgot. Is it C, X, no, 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 here we go. I just forgot which button it was. Uh, I need to equip clothes, change, secondary. Uh, no, not secondary. Uh, mm, uh, body gear? Yes, casual clothes. Do I need pants? Oh, look, I'm in clothes. Hey, come on now. I, I know. I know, Lanui. I'm wearing clothes, can't you tell? Okay, okay, okay. Okay, great. Looks good on you. <laughs> there we go. Follow me, please. You were very insistent that I get clothes on. You must not like the look of my nips. Is there a problem with my nips? You don't like to see them. Potion recipe one. Flame arrow through arrows. A sci-fi adventure with arrows. We're gonna go all like retro like swords and shields and stuff and everyone's gonna be shooting lasers at me like, what is this dude doing? Found two scrap wood. Wood. Found one luck rune. One luck plus one rune. It says agility on it, so we'll see what We'll see what that's about at some point. Okay, I don't think there's anything else down here. I do like the mini map. Uh, oh, I need to go this way, yes. Oh, that was a door. Oh, I see, okay. Oh, there's an item up here. Let's grab this. Can I grab this? Can I? There we go. Oh, some more wood. I've got wood. All right. Who are you, robot? Mecha fairy. Um, oh, mecha fairy. Fairy ambassador. <laughs> Welcome, human. I'm an ambassador for the mecha fairies within this universe. Mecha what? Um, perhaps you knew us better as fairies. Once Earth was destroyed, we had to learn to adapt within a more galactic environment. This suit is just a metal exterior. Our bodies are actually quite small and frail. Oh, so he's not a robot. There's a fairy inside the inside the mech suit. Uh, nice to meet you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep doing the robot voice, though. It's nice to meet you as well, Anuel. Apollo and Lanui have managed to find a decent bit of information about our history, or your history. I'll let them inform you of all the details. Uh, where am I? You're currently within an assembly point outpost. Your people have constructed these with the hope that they could outlive the harvest. What's the harvest? guess it didn't really work out. <laughs> I know, that seems a little sinister. I don't trust you, fairy. Fairy bot. I don't like you. I don't trust you for a second. Oh, what is this guy with the freaking skull face? Oh, I found five gold. Don't mind if I do. Who are you? Ooh, oh, that wasn't pleasant. Uh, you're finally up, I see. It's a Hopa merchant. I just sold the last of my supplies, but my brethren in space should deliver some more shortly. What are you? Me? You've never seen a Hopa? Jeez, you must have been out for a long time then. I'm a Hopa, from the planet Hopa. We like to refer to ourselves as the merchants of the universe. I left a rusted laser pistol in the next room. Maybe you could get some use out of it? The model in the room has a stun function. It might have a slower rate of fire than 
other blasters, but at least it could stop your enemies right in their tracks. Just remember, if you're ever out in space and need to repair your ship or refuel, seek out my Hopa brothers. Wait, you don't have a ship yet? Well, when you get one, make sure to seek us out. I like your clothes! Oh, um, oh, well thank you, this is actually a very common Hopa garb. Uh, Hopa wearing these clothes generally have some supplies, which they'd be willing to sell. Uh, what's going on? Oh, uh, you're asking me? The last time I was here, they were just hauling you in. Hmm, well, no, he seemed pretty relieved once they found you. I, I just sell the outpost supplies, though. I imagine Apollo would have m the information that you're seeking. I see. All right, well, let's exit. Let's grab this stun laser pistol. I am quite interested in re retrieving it. I bet it's in this green chest down here. Ooh, rusted laser pistol! Let's equip it before I forget! We've got a defender's blade, a blade made specifically for you during your time as a titan defender? What does that mean? Uh, my rusted laser pistol goes in the secondary, or maybe it can go in either. Uh, I don't know. Uh, how do I... Oh, X does. Okay, that's excellent. Uh, do I have any headgear? No. Uh, actually, does... Can I... No. 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 Okay, so we don't have any other gear, but we do have a rusted pistol and a defender's sword, which is pretty exciting. All right. Oh, and there's some more items up here. There's some more shiny items. we got some arrows. Uh, I don't think the arrows are going to help us with our laser pistol. we got um, a potion. Excellent. I hope that's for health. And not, it's not going to just turn me into some sort of, like, monster. <laughs> agility rune. Okay. An actual agility rune. This one said agility, not luck. Okay. Uh, where did Lanui go? Up here? Is this a staircase? It is. <laughs> Welcome, human! Or should I say, caveman? <laughs> Welcome to space. Main quest complete. Uh, mm, Lin oh, Lanui Unre is her full name. Uh, Lanui asked us to put clothes on. We did. Let's complete that. Uh, dot, dot, dot. Uh, your special skills are needed once more. Can you bring balance back to our universe? Uh, yes. Absolutely. <laughs> oh, got some karma. <laughs> Confident one you are. How reassuring. Your mind seems sharp, but what about your body? I've got this feeling that Apollo is a maniac, so that's what I'm doing. Um, Apollo wants to measure your strength. We have to defeat Apollo. I accept. Sure. Press Z for main attack. Oh, gosh. Now? Oh, oh, I skipped something. Press shift for dash and lock direction straight. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh, now? Do I want to do Oh, God. Oh, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not. Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! I, I, I don't. I don't think we're going. Uh, I'm not hitting shit. Oh, nearly dodged that one. I did. What you gonna do about this now? I'm gonna shoot you with. Oh, did we do it? I think we gained a level. <laughs> Anuel has gained a level. I think I've seen enough. Prove yourself. Main quest complete. Apollo wants to measure your strength. We did it, I think. I think we proved ourselves. I was hitting a couple of the wrong buttons, but that's okay. Apollo, we have enemy beacons appearing near our position. Ah, so many attacks recently. Hmm. It must have something to do with the titans I helped unleash. Unleash? I have a titan. To, I'm a titan defense. I'm sp what? That doesn't sound good. I don't like Apollo. I don't like him. You must be so confused, friend. Do you know that we found you drifting in the middle of deep space? Please trust me when I won't. When I say, if you would like to continue your new life positively, then you must follow my directions. Mm. Apollo? I don't think Lanui likes him either. You of all Mirans should know that free will is paramount. Huh. <laughs> friend. You are free to do as you please, but we know there are things that you are capable of. We're currently going through a cosmic event, which the entities of this universe refers to as the Harvest. 
The harvest is na a naturally occurring act which balances out the negativity in the universe. Is it like the purge? Is it the purge? Are we in some sort of galactic purge? Unfortunately, during the, during the process, the harvest destroys pretty much everything in its path. All of your, our technological achievements disappear. Our kindest people disappear. Only negative and lukewarm entities are left duking it out for, our, for survival across our harsh universe. My people, the Anukai, believe the harvest is an event of spiritual evolution. <sighs> It's quite debated, Lanui. We don't truly know what happens when people disappear during the harvest. On you well, right? Uh, if you're a, of a positive soul, assist us. I promise that I will explain everything to you. Might we all find salvation together? Oh gosh. Oh gosh, explosions. <laughs> Apollo! Orcus! Deserter Orcus. You weren't the only one looking for Titan Defenders! Mm. My! He looks capable! I'm surprised you found him before I did! Thanks for doing all of the hard work. <laughs> You're not taking him, Orcus. You will not use him for your negative deeds. Hmm. We will see. Are they gonna fight? You might have this decrepit Titan Defender, but I control the king of all Titans. <laughs> Oh gosh, what happened? Oh, what is that? Is that a dragon gargoyle thing? Uh, uh, excuse me. Annuel, please help us. Maybe Apollo's an okay guy after all. Ooh. We can save. Let's save. We'll save right there. Look, we have a save spot. Now what? I did it. Playtime, 17 minutes. Ooh, it's, we've been going for a Oh, I, I need to stop the episode. <laughs> All right, uh, how do we... Um, we saved. Total saves two. We saved twice in the same file. Do we, do we need to load it now? I think so. Oh, man. I think we should... I should probably cut the episode there. New location discovered. <gasps> there was like an explosion. What happened? We're on a planet now. Oh. All right, well, I'm going to stop the episode there. I think that's a good stopping spot where we, we uh, are on a planet now. Um, yes, some crazy stuff went down. Whatever ship we, we were on, or I think we were on a ship, just exploded. I think it was a ship. Maybe it was just a, a, a fortress. But it just exploded. We've met some new characters, Lanui and Orcus and Apollo. Um, all right. Um, I want to thank you all so much for watching, and I hope to see you on the next episode of Magic Man Mo. Bye! -bye.